Hey everybody, and welcome back to part three of the Let's Play The Sims 3 All-in-One. And I just wanted to talk to you guys really fast. Um, <coughs> sorry, I just ate something. Um, I have been working hard the last couple of days of getting a website put together for you guys where you guys can just go and check it all out, where my recent videos, posts will be, and everything. And... Um, I will have a link in the description to that and I will also be making a additional video with all of my social media links in it and that's going to be probably the first one that I show. Um, so I just want to let you guys know that I do have a website now. Um, it's on Blogspot, so it's blogspot.com, but I'm buying a domain, 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 whatever it's called, um, this month probably at the end of the month. So it'll change, of course, so yeah keep that in mind but everyone is waking up the kids are going to school kind of late though but eh, the kids are going to school story progression is just about to be booted up that's why i just did a little tiny lag there we go all right and i changed it to blood so i didn't get all the notifications but I have decided to leave Oreo with us. Um, someone told me not to put them up for adoption. So I guess I will keep Oreo. We'll try and sp spend at least a little bit of quality time with him. Um, we may end up going on races and stuff like that. So actually, speaking of which, let's go ahead and do that to right to now. Um, let's get ready. Oh, she's he's eating and stuff. So um, give him time really fast. Um, and then you can go ahead and, yeah, there we go. Is this, there we go. We're going to have to buy him another thing of hay, though, because he's running out. Oh, no. Um, I'm still giving, getting lag spikes in this game, but I understand that it's a, um, large little, um, uh, world, so, yeah, and yay, she actually came over, so this girl is Aurora Parker, she actually was from Kali Sims Generation Let's Play, I was a dumb butt, and in the last part, I was like, some random people just showed up, it was random, and I can tell you guys that now, um, so I have decided that I want Aiden and her to get together, so I'm gonna have Aiden or them get together know each other um i believe she's still a teen um yeah she's still a teen so um i'll get them to know each other and then when aiden ages up which is in one day i'm actually going to age them up this part um unless she's still with philip she may still be with philip if she's still with Philip, I may have to break them up because she is gorgeous and, you know, we want some good genes in this family. Um, doesn't she have a sister, though, too? And why aren't you in school? Why aren't you in school? That doesn't make any sense. Um, so now that we know her, she should show up. I think I placed them right here. Nope, that's the Funk family. Um, Clover, ooh, lag, 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 lag. I probably should reset this town. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pause it really fast. Mendez, Corona, where did I place them? Do I even remember? Psh, I don't even remember. Oh my god. Um, I could have sworn that it was not that far away. Hmm. Who knows? Who knows? Alright. I honestly don't think how... I don't know how long we're going to be in this world. If I'm already having issues trying to just go through a part already... Ooh, you better be be thinking I'm not going to be staying in here this long, so, yeah, um, I may have to do a full reset really fast, that'll take everybody out of school, and I don't want that to happen, all right, so we're going to go ahead and grab the mail, apparently, because we have mail, don't know why we have mail, but we got mail, 
Um, check out these. Perfect. Um, received iron ingot from the local smelting facility. Okay. All right. Looks like we got some stuff back. So let's go ahead and sell these the worthless crap. <laughs> Don't even remember when I smelted them, but okie dokie. All right. So let's go ahead and have her clean this up and have some leftover waffles for brunch because it is that brunch time and let's go ahead and have finley <clears throat> um go ahead and mount him Ooh, give him some attention i know she has a sister i don't know <clears throat> if she lives with them now that i think about it i think she lives in the household vera parker i don't i don't remember i didn't look oh his carpool arrives in two hours well, for two hours, they can ride together, I guess. I mean, it's going to take them two hours to get on the horse anyways. So, what's the difference? Come on. Time you get out, 6.30. Um, yeah, not even going to worry about it. Might as well let you eat instead. So he left over waffles and the waffle plate is in stuck inside of her hand. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Oh, gotta love the glitches. Mm. She should have her baby today. I'm pretty positive that she should have her baby today. Mm -hmm. Um, so, yeah. But when the kids get back from school, I will age them all up. Because I think it's about that time um to age them up they've been a child for um a while now i guess so yes um no we are not going to egypt yet no 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 i do plan on going to into the into the future and all of that fun stuff but i will wait i'm gonna wait until it's just finley's family finley and patricia's family i don't know why i followed him to work Guys, I've been, I was just talking to you guys and I kind of just was confused. Anyways, um, but I'm going to wait to go into the future with Finley and Patricia's family. Just because I think it would be kind of pointless to go with everybody. Because that would just drive me up the wall. Um, for sure. But we have like gnomes all over the place. And it's kind of interesting. All right, so let's go ahead. You need a hobby, Patricia. You need a hobby. Um, what can I do for you? Let's see what we can buy. She needs something to do because I don't want her to sit at home all day and be boring for you guys and everyone's at work and school and such, so... Um, let's see. I should probably buy, like, a fish aquarium. Um, that would be kind of pretty. Put it right here. Yeah. I like that idea. Um, num, 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 num. I could buy this. But I could just place the lot. I think I'll just place the lot for that. And that way we can go over there. I do have a couple lots that I do want to place um, in this world, but I don't want to do it while I'm recording because it will take a while. So um, let's go ahead and talk to our partner. Do we know our partner? Okay. Ask and see if she wants to come on over. I'm pretty sure she's at work, but you never know. Mm, yeah, she's at work. All right, so let's go ahead. Oh, God. Can we question our own mother? Friendly. Um, I don't know if we can. Study together? What? Um, special? Nope. 
Doesn't look like we can question her. We can recruit, though, somehow. I don't know what that means. Come here, mama. See what she Not sure what recruitment means. I've never... I've never done this. Uh... This lifetime wish. Alright, so I guess we can't, like... Um, question her. So... Um... Go ahead and invite over. Who is that? I have no idea. No idea. Alright, let's go ahead and invite over her, maybe. Invite household over. Why can't we invite over Aurora Parker? Huh? Huh? Why not? Doesn't make any sense. Alright, well... I guess we'll question someone else. I don't know. Um, actually, you know what? Invite over her. That'll work. She is probably at work. Um, invite over her. I don't know who you are. Probably the mascot. And of course she'll come over. Cause she has nothing better to do. Okay, we're just gonna wait for her to show up. Um, gotta keep checking back over here for our plant sim bubbas. She still has not shown up, so. Is that her? No. What the hell? Oh, there she is. I didn't even see her. Like, what? Alright, let's go ahead and do, 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 do invite inside. <laughs> Who is this girl? She's super cute. She's super pretty. Alright, there we go. Let's go ahead and do, 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 do. question. There we go. Come on, girl. Water all over there. Lag, 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 lag. Big time lag. Holy. Wasn't expecting that. Where, what are you doing? I'm doing with the difficult. Sure. Alright, go ahead and question him. And you guys, I'm going to turn on testing cheats enabled. And I'm going to have them start aging up. So, Wendy. Once you're actually home, apparently. Trigger age transition. This is a cheap way of doing... Maybe we need to be friends with her more. Probably. Um, let's try that. I keep yawning. I'm sorry, guys. But this is a cheap way of age thing aging them up. Um, cause I honestly think it's okay for me to age them up because, you know, they've been a child forever, but... Due to her indifferent study habits, you will not be allowed to choose a trait for her to develop. Okay. So there is Wendy. Um, on to the next. Mark. Alright, there we go. And, Wendy, you need to... Uh, eat something. Go ahead and have some macaroni and cheese. And then take a shower. You don't need to be involved in this birthday party. Um. 
All right. Um, he has been developed into the workaholic trait. What did Wendy develop again? I think it's the ambitious trait. I'm pretty positive. All right. 975 simoleons. Sweet, sweet. Are you broken, Aiden? Are you broken? No? Okay, good. Phew! Because I know that Ashley has trouble aging people up, so I was really hoping that didn't happen. Didn't I tell you? Freaking continue cooking. Um, heavy sleeper trait. Alright, fine by me. Well, dude, come downstairs and shower really fast. Your sister's cooking dinner. They really do need some freaking makeovers, though. Big time. Alright. When's Finley coming home? Let's have him. Do we have a equestrian center here? I don't think there is an equestrian center here, so I may have to plot that down before we even start doing that again. Oh, there is. Looks like. Okay, so. Um. Go here after work. And I'm just gonna teleport the horse here. Because it t it'll take too long to get him actually here. So. Um, go here. And then Oreo. Go ahead and teleport here. There we go. Alright. Actually, I'm going to teleport him here as well. I don't like doing this, but um, I do want them to go into competitions. And it'll just take a long time if I have him go home and whatnot, so. Hey, right, go, go, go. Come on. Jesus. Alright, go ahead and attend racing and jumping probably. If you have enough time for the jumping, probably not. But let's do the racing one. Oh! And the baby's coming. Um. Okay then. Go to the hospital. Um. The baby daddy will not be there. He's busy working. So... Yeah. Just an FYI, girl. Just an FYI. Alright, let's go. Ooh, first. I didn't even look at their skills. So now that I know that he's going to jump up to first, like, in no time, in the beginning racing one, then I should probably remember Alright, so it's a new baby boy, and it was born with the virtuoso trait, and you'll get to choose his second trait. So I'm going to go ahead and call him, um, alright, he's going to be named Ryan. And we are going to randomize, alright. Okay. So there's Ryan. Yay. How cute. And baby boy. They've had both boys. They haven't had a girl yet. That's funny. Alright, come on. Hurry up. We gotta buy him a crib. Yay, he won. Oh wow, his skill's actually kind of uh, high. So, good to know. Alright, why 
Freaking grab a plate. Come on, dude. Jesus, she's like starving herself to death. God dang. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and get a crib and put it in their room. Just because we don't have any place to put it anywhere else. Um, let me go ahead and buy this one. All right, there we go. And what does the baby need? Just energy. So go ahead and put Ryan in the crib. And then you yourself should go to bed as well. Um, Finley, go ahead and come on home. And when you come home, go ahead and sleep. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Alright. They should be on their way. It's going to take them a little while, but that's okay. They're so cute. Maybe it's a good thing I'm not going to put them up for adoption because Oreo is super cute. And, you know, it's going to be something Finley and him have together. And I think it'll be kind of cute to keep them and just have fun. And do random, random shows and competitions and stuff like that. So, y'all. Yeah. All right. So, they're going to just worry up and hurry up and get home. And she actually wants to learn how to drive. Um, okay. We all want to learn how to or drive. He wants to get a part-time job. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give him a makeover really fast. I'm going to do it on screen so you guys can see and everything and get my reaction and do what they look like. I honestly don't think Wendy's that cute. Um, she has a very long and face, and she has really big lips so and really bushy eyebrows so we are definitely going to change that um but hopefully she grows more into her lips because they could be cute if they weren't so big you know and pointy at the bottom if that makes sense so let's go ahead and give her thinner eyebrows those will be good all right and let's give her I think I need something that, like, covers half of her face. Like, she looks better with that. Um. This hair makes any sim look cute. Um, 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 um. One has really bad textures. I'm gonna give her that one and then give her some makeup I don't like that that much. Let's go ahead and give her that. That looks better. And tone it down a bit. Um, I'm gonna give her some eyelashes. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. They don't really like go with her eyes though. So, I'm not going to give her eyelashes because her eyes are just too, I don't know how to explain it, too angly, I guess. I don't know. Um, let's go ahead and give her over that. She looks a little better with makeup on and stuff, so 
I mean, she doesn't look super cute, but she does look better with makeup on, so. Give her a quick little sleepwear. Alright, so every day was kind of fugly, so let's fix that right now. <clears throat> Alright. Let's rephrase that. That's fugly. That's not close to being fugly. That's fugly. <laughs> Alright, come on. Close load it up. There we go. I kind of like that if, like, that was a way. I don't think I can get rid of it. Nope, I can't. But that would be super cute if that little pattern was away and didn't exist on these clothes. But they will not go away. Um, let's see what else I have. Let's see. We have to just give her some regular pants, maybe. Do have this skirt, too. Don't want her to look like a complete slut. It's not cute. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and give her that, those pants. And then, let's see if there is any different shirts that I did not see. Um, I kind of like that on her, especially with those pants. I think they fit perfectly. So I'm going to go ahead and give her that. Change her shoe colors to the blue. Very laid back look for sure. The last part of this episode will be giving makeovers just so you guys know because um i have about oops i just had my desk sorry i have about like eight minutes until it's like 30 ish minutes so I might as well spend it uh giving makeovers i'm gonna use finally a homecoming parts of it's from the sims store um the homecoming set that comes with like really cute cute dresses for their formal wear so i'm gonna use that um. All right, athletic. I honestly don't care about athletic, so as long as it's so not cool. fugly, that looks fine. I'll leave it. Um, but sometimes I just oh, don't really care that? about their um athletic wear. I'm gonna go ahead and give her some into the future swimwear. What the heck is going on right here? Holy cow, that is not cute. No, 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 no. Alright. There we go. There's Wendy. And on to you, the boys. They're going to be a lot quicker than her because I don't have as much boy content as I do girl oh, content. Do. So, it should go... A lot, a lot faster. All right. So let's go ahead and do Mark. Um, sure. I was gonna go through uh, Master Controller, but that works too. Mark looks a lot better than her. He got the good jeans. He has like wide, like a wide jaw, but that's about it. You got the good jeans. And I kind of want to use this hair. Um, yeah, I think I want to use this hair. Change this to like a darker color. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Maybe, just maybe some different eyebrows. Yeah, that's better. 
His sleepwear is fine besides his pants. Those need to be changed. Um, there we go. His everyday wear. Let's see. His everyday wear. Oh. Okay, then. <laughs> um, go ahead and give him those pants. I always use, like, the university life stuff for, like, boys, like, the pants and stuff because they're the only ones that actually look like they fit decent, you know? All the other ones are just, like, plastered on almost. It's really weird. All right, I'm going to give him that. Same with the shoes. They're, like, super cute shoes. Like, I like the, like, the combat feel of these ones, but they're nice and fanciful. Sashko. No, 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 no. That does not work. Um, let's go ahead and give them, let's give them that, along with some base game shoes. All right. So, so. Athletic is actually fine. Don't mind it. Yep, so. Um, but that has to go. Along with the that stuff and that stuff. Yes, see, ma. All right. Outerwear. Mardunsa. Outerwear is fine, besides the pants and probably. And the shoes, but the pants probably need to go. Um, actually, I'm just going to leave them with that, but just change the color. Alright, so there's Mark. Now on to the last one, Aiden. They're almost like triplets because they were like born like a day apart, but now that... I've aged them up early. They're pretty much like triplets. So it's kind of funny. Alright. Edit and create a sim. Okay. Let's give him some different eyebrows. What's up with all these bushy, bushy, bushy eyebrows? Don't get it. And that hair's got to go. It doesn't fit you. Be fine. But it doesn't fit you. Like, at all. Um, give him the short version of that. Sleepwear is fine, actually. Brunardar. <laughs> His everyday wear? No, 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 no. Uh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Not working. I hate how there's, like, no outfits for the teenage boys from the game and not, like, custom content or store content and stuff like that. I think that's dumb. Create a sim takes so long to load. Alright, um, what am I looking for? That works. And then... Same shoes as Mark. Make it easy. Sashko. Um, let's go ahead and give them... Give them that. <laughs> give them some zebra. Oh god. That'd be funny. Yep so. Okay, athletic wear and just make sure it's not fugly. Medio. Like that sweatshirt. Um that sweatshirt has got to go. Let's go ahead and give uh -oh. him like a evil freezer bunny. There we go. <laughs> Still not cute, but it's better than what it was. Outerwear. Mardunsa. I don't like those pants at all from base game. They're they're super ugly. Ah. Honestly, ugh, grosses me out just looking at them. 
All right, so that is all the makeovers. Sorry if that was boring. Does he have an... What? An eyebrow go. piercing? Am I, like, going crazy? Please don't say that you have an eyebrow piercing. Because I did not put you in an eyebrow piercing. I don't know. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But, all right, guys. So, I'm going to have everybody go to bed now. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this part. And I hope you guys have a awesome... Awesome, 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 awesome day, and I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye, everyone.